Hello, I'm Jana, a student at the University of Pennsylvania, and this is Art at Home with Spiral Q. Today's activity is making a colorful, expressive self-portrait. Sometimes self-portraits are realistic, and sometimes they're more abstract. I made two examples of some different styles you might like. You can use any materials for this. Feel free to get creative and experiment with your surface. I'm reusing the back of some old paper I had lying around. You can also use a lot of different drawing tools. At Spiral Q, we like to encourage everyone to express themselves. You can draw yourself however you want. Today, we're using color to make expressive, vibrant self-portraits. Here's a quick overview of some colors and the feelings they're associated with. Red for anger or love. Yellow for happiness. Green for peace, nature, or healing. Blue for trust or sadness. And pink for love. I'm going to start with drawing a head shape. I find it helpful to start with one color, but definitely don't feel limited to just one. I also added some lines around my head. I've been thinking a lot about the protests going on, so I used the lines to represent them. I put red for the passions, feeling the people behind them, yellow for the joy I feel thinking about change happening, and green for the hope of a renewed system. Now, these definitely don't look exactly like me, but I'm focusing more on making a colorful, expressive drawing that reflects me in a different way. Don't be afraid to really experiment with color and try new things out. My hair definitely isn't blue, but it's fun to draw myself as if it was. You can show how you view yourself in this drawing. Here's my second one. I used more bold lines when I was making this one, and exaggerated some of my features, like my hair. You can also use different amounts of pressure with some materials and get lighter or darker color. You could even try filling up space with different patterns, like I'm doing with my hair in the background. Once you're done, try thinking about what your drawing makes you feel when you look at it. Do you feel excited? Overwhelmed? Happy? It could take on a lot of different meanings. Hope you have fun trying this at home!